Alright guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get console performance mode. And this is just an updated one if you guys saw my other one. But I'm just going to re-show you guys because they did tweak it and make it a little bit better and more playable. So basically, all you want to do is go to your Microsoft Edge that is built into your Xbox. Or I don't know if PS5 has it, but you might be able to. But just go to your apps and hit Microsoft Edge. Then you'll be brought to like a new tab. Then you want to do is type in GeForce now, and then it'll be brought to this page. And once you get it, you're going to have to sign in and make it an account. It's free. Um, There is different memberships, so you like can get in, by the way, but you just got to sign in quickly. And then basically, you want to find Fortnite and then just click play. And then you will be brought into like a waiting queue. So like there's only 40 people ahead of me since I didn't pay. To upgrade my membership it's going to take a little bit but yeah i'll get back to you once uh it i'm loaded into fortnite and i'll tell you how long it took me to get in there all right so i'm back it only took like five minutes um and that's with the free version i bet if i upgraded to like a decent membership for like 15 bucks i would get in instantly but now you asked to sign in so i'm gonna sign in real quick and i'll be right back all right once i signed in you're in the epic games launcher and then you're just gonna load up fortnite you can close out of this or we'll just minimize it. And you just gotta wait until uh, Fortnite loads in and I'll be back. Oh, well, never mind, it's right here. And I've heard that, I'm only making this new one because I heard that they updated it. So like, it's actually pretty good now and it's actually playable. So I might wanna let you guys know. But yeah, there's different memberships on GeForce where you would, could get in instantly, but it only took me five minutes and I have the free membership, so I, I think it's best off not to pay for it. But yeah, as you can see, I'm on console. Okay, what is this? Okay. I can't undo it, so we're gonna have to watch this. How long did this take? Hold up, I'll be right back once it's done. Okay, now that we're in, you can just scroll down. Actually, we need to use this slider. You can see I'm on performance mode. The thing is, I don't understand, but you cannot use your controller. I don't understand. Like, sometimes it works. Like, you can see like this. But, like, you still can't, like, I don't know. Maybe it's just, like, this controller, but sometimes it's buggy. I don't understand. I'm going to try to load into, like, a creative and see if I can move. But it, it works perfectly fine on the keyboard which is weird. So maybe if you like keyboard and mouse on console, I feel like it's better, but we'll see if we can use it on controller. Uh, yeah. But yeah, you can like go full screen or not full screen. Um, but yeah, I wanna see if this, you can even use it. Maybe I'm doing something wrong or I have like a different controller. So it appears, yeah. So you can move around. Okay, but you can't. Oh, it feel, oh, the binds are weird, I think. So I can move around, okay. Yeah, so you can play on it. I'm kind of curious on how much FPS I actually get. Okay, I'm gonna have to use my, this for it. I, I actually wanna see how much FPS I would get. Let me go to my settings. So I can up this up to 360. Bluetooth 40 and just see. But yeah, I feel like this is actually better for Mouse players, because there's, I mean, keyboard and mouse players on console. But yeah. You guys can see I am on performance mode on console. But yeah, it looks pretty good. It is very buggy on controller, as you can see. I think because it's the cursor, but it actually looks pretty nice. It actually did a lot of better job on it now. So maybe soon. I don't know why it doesn't work fully on, like, when I'm moving. That's I'm not supposed to do that. But yeah, it looks pretty good. Uh, try to do it down uh, on your Xbox and see if it's better than mine or do something. I don't know. It looks pretty good, but try on keyboard and mouse, see if it's any better. 
Like, it looks like it works perfectly fine on keyboard and mouse. So, if you guys play keyboard and mouse on console, definitely try this out. On controller, I don't know. It's bugging out for me. But, yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video or found it helpful, make sure you guys drop a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.